right, I like cartoons. Yay! You know? <laughs> you know? What? What you doing? I'm doing homework. What? Homework. Oh, what kind of homework? Math. Do you know? I'm gonna go there. No. You don't coming. You know. What? You're not doing math. You're watching cartoons. I know. I'm sorry. Cut off, cut off the cartoons. You got, we're going to have Bible study now. Okay. You know. Cut it off first. Cut it off. Cut it off. You know. When I ask you what you're doing, you have to be truthful. You know that, right? I'm sorry. You have to tell the truth always. Don't do that, okay? You said you're doing math, but you're watching cartoons. I'm sorry. Okay. Now we're going to go do Bible study. Learn about God, okay? Okay. You ready? Yeah. Okay. Let's go. Okay. Well, hello, Dino. Hi. <laughs> How was your time off? Oh, it was great. <laughs> well... Oh, you're ready to start uh, Bible study again? Oh, yeah. I miss it. You miss it? Hi, kids. Yeah, the kids are there. Oh, hopefully, they're in chapel right now, and they're just waiting for us. You know, they've been off for about two weeks, and and, and we want to get back. We're anxious to get back, right? Yeah. You want to get back? You got a sore throat? No. <laughs> okay. I think you do. No, I don't. <laughs> okay. All right, we're going to get together again, get back in the routine of doing things, and say hello to the kids again. Hi, kids. Yeah, we want to say hello, and we want to start. Again, we're, we're in this book that we've been reading. We've been reading called Truths. Um, we're going to continue. We're doing lessons on there. Yeah. And I'm going to read again. And like always, yeah. if you have a question, uh -huh. if you have a question, I would just want you to ask, okay? Because we've been learning a lot, right? We've been learning about the Holy Spirit, about God being in you, right? Yeah, you've been learning a lot? Oh, yeah. You'll be ready to learn more? Yeah. Okay, we're going to talk this, this morning. We're going to be talking about prayer. In case if you have your Bibles, we're going to be in, we're going to open off in Romans uh, eight twenty six. Okay. Okay. Let me read here a little bit, and then just as you see, just go ahead and ask me anything you want. Okay. Okay. We're going to talk about praying. Do you pray? Uh, sometimes. Sometimes, <laughs> you're supposed to pray all the time. Yeah. Yeah. We're going to learn about that. We're going to learn how to pray and when to pray and why it's important to pray. Okay. See what that means. All right. Okay. Okay. Prayer is actually talking to God. Huh? Yeah. You know, you talk to God by prayer. Oh, yeah? Yeah, that's how we talk to God. We talk to Him, and we, we say God, and we pray to Him, and then He hears us. Oh. Okay, let's learn more about it this morning, okay? Okay. Okay. Okay, reading. Romans 8, 26 says like this. The Holy Spirit, we've been talking a lot about the Holy Spirit, right? Where's the Holy Spirit? Inside me. Yeah, inside you, inside Dino. Yeah. The Holy Spirit is there. It says the Holy Spirit helps us in our weakness. And for example, we don't know what God wants us to pray for. No. No, a lot of times we don't know. It's through the Holy Spirit helps us. Because why? Uh, I don't know. Remember what I said? Yeah. Where's the Holy Spirit? Inside uh, Dino. Yeah, inside Dino. And a lot of times we don't know what to pray about. But because the Holy Spirit is inside me... It's inside you, <laughs> inside me and you. The Holy Spirit helps us to pray because sometimes we, we as humans, we don't know what to pray for. Okay, for example, we don't know what God wants us to pray for. But, mm -hmm. but the Holy Spirit for us with groanings that cannot be expressed in words. That means because of the Holy Spirit that's inside of Dino. Yeah inside of me inside there with the kids when you receive jesus christ as your whole is your lord and savior the holy spirit teaches us what to pray for because a lot of times we don't know what to pray for no no we don't okay let me ask let's start off like this do you know yeah do you pray uh sometimes sometimes when you pray dina yeah what do you pray for huh let me ask you what do you pray for what, what are the kind of things you pray for uh, toys. Toys? Yeah. Games. Games? <laughs> yeah. Oh, do you pray for those kind of things? Yeah. <laughs> well, let's talk about here. Let's see what prayer is all about. <coughs> there are many kinds of prayers. Oh, yeah? Yeah, many kinds of prayers. You might pray. How about this? You know, in the morning? Yeah. What's the first thing you do when you get up in the morning? Uh, What's the first thing you do? For every first thing you do when you get up in the morning, what do you do? Get up, get up in bed, right? What do you do? What's the first thing? Uh, 
No, I tell me. What do you do? I don't know. Yeah, you know. Think. Think. What should you do when you get up in the morning? Uh, yawn. <laughs> yawn. Well, I guess that's part of it. Uh, open your eyes. Open your eyes? Yeah. Well, that's. I guess that's important too. Uh, eat breakfast. Eat what? Breakfast. Eat breakfast? Yeah. Well, okay. Well, I'm talking the very first thing that we should do in the morning. Yeah. We should be thankful to God because God gave us life. Huh? Yeah. You woke up in the morning because God wanted Dino to live. God wanted, wanted you to live. And he wanted me to live and the kids out there. So the first thing we should do in the morning is pray. Yeah? Oh. Just tell God thank you. Oh. Like this. Uh, God, thank you for uh, a, a, a good morning. Thank you, God, that I'm alive. And thank you, God, for another beautiful day. Oh. Yeah. Like that? Yeah, like that. That's all? That's all. <coughs> That's all God wants. He just wants us to realize that He is God. And we, we always have to be thankful. Yeah. Yeah. Meaning things God, you know, waking up in the morning. Yeah. Waking up in the morning is God gave you another day of, of what? Uh, food? No. <laughs> well, that's part of it. God gave you another day, not food, but God gave you an, another day of life. Oh. Yeah. God gave you another day of life, so He wants you to be thankful. Oh, okay. So you get up in the morning. First thing you want to say is, God, thank you. Good, thank you. What? For another day. For another day. See, we just do that in the morning. Do you do that? You know? Huh? <laughs> do you do that? Do you do that? Wake up in the morning and tell God thank you? Uh, do, do you know? What? I'm just asking you a question. What? <laughs> I'm asking you, do you get up in the morning? Yeah. Do you tell God thank you? No. <laughs> no. Don't feel bad. Many people don't. I want you to learn this, okay? Get up in the morning. Yeah. Get up in the morning and say what? Thank you, God. Thank you. Yeah. For another day. Okay. You learned that? Yeah. Another thing we pray for, it says here, we might pray over a uh, our food, our meal. So you get up in the morning. Yeah. You go to the table. Yeah. You see? Right? You go to the table. Yeah. And what do you do there? Come on. Tell me. Uh, what do you do there at the table? Uh, Come on. You know. I eat. Yeah. You eat. Yeah. But what do you do before you eat? Uh... Get a plate. <laughs> get a plate. Spoon. Spoon. Yeah. Before you get a plate and spoon, you, you put it there in front of you. Before you eat, what, you know, we thank God for waking up in the morning. Yes. Yeah. You also want to thank God for what? For the meal. For the food. Oh. Yeah. Who gave you the food? You. <laughs> well, no, not me. <laughs> Mama. But who gave us the food? Where, where did our food come from? I don't know. It came from God. God? Yeah. Pay less. Pay less. No, not pay less. All the food that we have, everything that we have, comes from a source. God provides everything. Yeah. Yeah, even the food. Yeah. Yeah. So before you eat, say grace. Huh? You do that? Grace. Yeah. Grace. Grace. No, not that. Well, that's being thankful. You go to the... your your Before you eat your food... Turn to God, close your head, bow your eyes, and say like this, say like this. Say like this, bow your head, close your eyes. Can you close your eyes? Okay, close your eyes. <laughs> you get your eyes closed? Yeah. Okay, close your eyes. And say, thank you, God. Thank you, God. For my food. For my food. Okay, is that hard? No. You know what? God loves that. Oh. You know what? God knows you need food. Yeah. He knows. And? The way we uh, show that we are thankful, we just tell them, thank you, God. Oh. Yeah, so we thank you. So, there are many kinds of prayer that you might pray. You might pray over your food for your meal and, and thank God for the food that you eat. Another thing in prayer, you might pray that God will help others when they're in, in need. Oh. Yeah. A lot of times, people in the world, you know, like, here, the, this shirt you got? Yeah. Mama saw you needed the shirt. Yeah. And Mama got you a shirt. Yeah. But a lot of times we're going to see people in the world. They need things. They need things. And we should pray for them. People in our church. People in, in your family. Yeah. 
They need things. They may need food. They may need resources. And we need to pray for other people. Mm. Who do you pray for? Huh? Do you pray for them? No. <laughs> we need to pray for other people. A lot of times we go to God. Yeah. We go to God and we say, God, give me this. Oh, give me that? Yeah, give me this. Give me that. Give me this. Give me that. Who are you talking to? <laughs> talking to God. <laughs> talking to God. We say, God, give me, give me a car. Yeah. <laughs> God, give me good grades. Yeah. <laughs> but that's how we do it. Me, me, me. Yeah. yeah, that's how we pray all the time. We shouldn't pray like that all the time. No. No. We should pray. And, and this is hard to do. Yeah. Pray for the needs of other people. Oh. Yeah. Other people have needs. Do you know? Do you know? What? <laughs> Listen to what I'm saying. Oh, okay. Pray for the needs of people. Needs? Yeah. What they need. Uh, like car? Well, maybe some people need a car. But daily needs. What are your daily needs? Huh? Do you know what your daily needs are? No. Daily needs. Every day you need what? Food. Yeah. You eat food every day? Yeah. Uh, every day you need a, a place to live. Your home. Yeah. Every day you need to be safe, right? Yeah. Pray for people's daily needs. You know, every day, you know, every day, every day I, I, I pray for you. Yeah. I pray for the people in the church. Yeah. And I pray for the people that are taking ministries in the church. Yeah. And I pray for all the leaders. And they I even pray for your teachers. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> Have you ever prayed for your teachers? Do you know? What? Have you ever prayed for your teachers? Do you know? What? Your teachers, do you know? Mm. <laughs> yeah, they, you know teachers take time. They take time to go here on Zoom, go in class. They take time to teach you. Are you thankful for that? Hmm? No. <laughs> Why? I don't think of that. You don't think of that? No. Well, think about that. Your parents, your teachers, the policemen, the firemen, the, the guys in the military, all take time to take care of us. And we should pray for them. Your, your teachers in school and church, take time because, you know why? Because they love Dino. Yeah. And they love Dino. So they, you take time to pray for them, okay? Okay. Okay. Learn that. So you pray when you wake up in the morning. Yeah. You pray when you eat. Yeah. And you pray for the needs of other people, okay? Okay. Okay. Uh... Pray for forgiveness. Forgiveness. You know, you, don't, you know what I mean by that? No. Forgiveness. Have you done things wrong? Hmm? Do you know? What? Have you done things wrong? <laughs> Do you know? <laughs> I keep on doing that, huh? Look up. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. Have you ever done anything wrong? Mm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, we ask for forgiveness. Especially to who? Huh? Oh, oh look up there. Look. Especially to Him. You ask forgiveness from God. Because you know what? God sees every, everything you do. God sees. <laughs> yes. He sees everything you do. And sometimes, sometimes we don't do the right thing, right? Hmm? Yeah. Sometimes we do the wrong thing, right? Right. So we have to ask forgiveness from God. Because God sees us. God can see your heart. He sees your heart. Yeah. You can see my heart there. You see? God can see everybody's heart. Everybody, even the kids. Yeah? Yeah. So we pray for forgiveness. Now, here's another thing. Here's an important thing. This is why we're here. Okay, This is why we're here. We pray yeah. for people so they can know Jesus. Yeah? Yeah. You ever done that before? Do you know people who don't know Jesus? Yeah, a lot. You know a lot of people? Yeah. Do they know Jesus? No. No. You know how they're going to know? Uh, church? Well, maybe. Uh, through you? Through me? Pastor? Yeah. Well. Teachers? No. The easiest way people can know about Jesus is through Dino. Yeah, what do you do that for? They learn Jesus through you. You know what you can do? What? You can pray for them. Huh? Yeah. Pray for your friends and people that you know that don't know Jesus. Pray for them that they can know Jesus too. Oh. Yeah. You know what happens? What? The Holy Spirit, the Holy, the Holy Spirit, the Holy Spirit. What happened? <laughs> Sorry, I have to go answer the phone. Okay. Okay, let's continue. We're talking about the Holy Spirit, right? Yeah. 
we said you need to pray for people so they can come to know Christ. The, the Holy Spirit will go into their hearts. You know, when you pray for, for people to know God, guess what God does? Ah, God makes a way. Ah, okay. And now another prayer, another prayer that we should all do, everyone is there, the students, us, myself, even you, a prayer of thankfulness. Oh. That means being thankful for the things God gives you. You know, God has given you a lot of things, right, Dino? Yeah. Yeah, you you have a lot. Of, you got a new shirt. You, you got food to eat. You have friends, right? You go to school. Yeah, God is good. Yeah, God is really good. So, take time every day and tell God, thank you. You know, tell God, thank you. Thank you, God. You know, have you do that? Do you do that? <laughs> Dino. What? Dino. No. <laughs> no. We always forget. Kids, do not forget to tell God thank you. Okay, okay. What are you going to do? I was going to say something. What are you going to say? Uh, I forgot. <laughs> We're praying to say, God, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, thank you, God. Say thank you, God. Thank you, God. For the things you have. Okay? All right. Let's learn the truth this morning. We're talking about prayer, okay? Okay, let's learn the truth. Uh, do you know that God prays? Yeah, God prays. No. Yeah, God prays. And did you know what? What? Jesus prayed. Did you know that? No. Yeah, Jesus prayed. You know, many times, you know, when Jesus was, was alive and he was here on the on the planet, when Jesus was here on the planet, when he was living here on earth, he would take time to pray. Oh. Yeah, he would. And, and many times when he was here, when he was walking on the earth, he would be with his disciples he would be with his disciples, and, and then he felt like he needed to talk to God. You know what he would do? No. He would slip away. He would slip away from his disciples and spend long times of praying to God. Hmm. Did you know that? No. You know what prayer is? No. Prayer is actually you and I were talking to God, just talking to Him, just being close to Him. You know, God wants to be close to you. Yeah. Yeah. Let me give you an example. Uh, you know my my son, right? You know my son uh, Marty, right? Yeah. Marty, I love Marty, my boy. Yeah. I love when Marty comes to the house, and he comes here, and we talk. Huh? Why? I don't know. What? Because he's my boy. He's my son. Yeah. And I like talking to you. Yeah. Because I can sit here, and I can talk to you, right? Yeah. You know what? What? That's what God wants too. Too. Oh. Yeah. He wants to talk to Dino. He wants to talk to all those there in class that are listening right now. God wants to talk to us. You know what we do many times? What? We go, we, we pray to God. We go like this. Thank you, God, for this. Thank you, God, for that. Thank you. Amen. <laughs> yeah, that's what we do. And God says, well, who was that? <laughs> do you do like that sometimes? Uh, yeah. You talk room. You try to make prayer last one in a couple of seconds? Yeah. <laughs> you know, God wants to hear your voice, Dino. Yeah. yeah, he wants to hear your voice. He wants you to hear him talk to him. Say, God, I love you. I, I, I want to talk to you. I want to tell you what's happening in my life, God. Oh, he likes that? Yeah, he likes to hear that. He knows what's happening in your life already. He knows. You, you're not going to surprise him, no. But, he's, but he wants you to tell him. He wants you to take time to be with him. You know, that's the most important thing, Dino. Spending time with God, right? Yeah. Do you spend that much time with Him? No. You should. I want you to start spending time with God. You can read His Word in His... in His Where? Where's His Word? I don't know. The Bible. Oh, yeah. The Bible. Read His Word there. And take time to get away, close your eyes, and, and just look up to heaven and just talk to God, okay? Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. And that's what Jesus did. He took time, just a long time, just to talk to His Father. Those prayers were not only for his followers at that time on earth, but Jesus also prayed for everyone who would believe. Wow. Do you know, do you know what that means? Huh? Do you know what that means? Jesus not only prayed for his disciples, but Jesus also prayed for everyone out there, all those that are listening there, all the students, everybody around the world, everybody everywhere, everywhere. He was praying for everyone who would believe in him. Oh. That means, that means, you know what that means? No. That means that Jesus was praying for Dino. Huh? Jesus was praying for a pastor. Huh? Jesus was praying for them. 
the students. Oh, oh. Yeah, all of them. He was praying for them. He included us in his prayers for anyone who would believe in him. Do you believe in Jesus? Yes. Do you believe he loves you? Yes. Yes, yes. That's what he was praying for. This includes you. The scripture says we have an advocate. We have an advocate with the Father. What is an advocate? I don't know. An advocate is like uh, like a like a like a lawyer, someone who's standing, you know, right there next to God, standing right next to God, and 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 standing for you, Dino. Me? Yeah, standing for you. He's saying, God. God. You know, he's saying, God. Yeah. Listen to Dino. Oh. He's he, he, he's your uh, he's your supporter. He's your lawyer. He, he's the one who speaks for you to God. Yeah. Yeah. He does that for me. Yeah, for you. He is your advocate, the Bible says, to the Father. Jesus Christ, the righteous one. First John 2 1, it says that. If you want to look at your Bibles, first John 2 1, it says that. And in your weakness, and when you don't know how to pray or what to pray for, the Holy Spirit prays for you. Wow. Yeah. So you learned a lot about prayer. You learn your prayer when you get up in the morning, pray when you eat, before all the meals, pray when you feel the Holy Spirit. Uh, telling you to pray for someone, uh, pray for needs of other people, pray for people to know Christ. Yeah. That's what you pray for. You pray for things like that, okay? Look what it says here. It says that God is not a distant God. He's so far away. I know, but He's not that far away. No. No. He said, our God is not a distant God. No. No, He's near. He's near to us. He's not far from us. And I says, it says, you are not distracted, God, too busy to take notice to me. That means that, that God is not too busy. No. He's not too busy. He can still take time for Dino. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Ah. Yeah, he takes time. But he's so doing a lot of things, God. Yeah, he's doing a lot of things. He takes care of the whole world, right? Right. But he takes care of also Dino. Me? Yeah, even you, Dino. He loves Dino. Oh. Yeah. So... He knows everything. And God, you guess what? But you know what? What? He is interested in everything you do, Dino. Huh? Yeah, everything. Huh? Yeah, all things you do. Everything? Everything, Dino. Oh? Yes, oh. And he knows how many hairs you have in here. <laughs> See your hairs here? <laughs> Dino, give me your hair. Yeah. He knows how many hairs you have in your head. Yeah. Yeah. How many? I don't know how many, but he knows. He knows how many. You know why? Because he loves you. And he wants to care for you. That's why. So, won't you help people know about Christ? Yeah. Now, are you going to pray more often now, Dino? Yeah. You know, you know when to pray. There's a lot of things to pray for. A lot of things. But get up in the morning. Be thankful to God. Pray for your food. Pray for those who don't know Christ. Pray for forgiveness of our sins because we always do wrong. Right? We always do wrong. Right, Dino? Yeah. Pray, pray that God will forgive you and He'll forgive you, okay? Okay. Okay. Did you learn something? Yeah. Did you learn how to pray now, Dino? Oh, yeah. Are you going to do it now? Yes. Okay. Okay, kids, that's all we're doing this morning. I pray that you had a good uh, time off and we're going to get ready now. So we're praying for you, Dino and I, right, Dino? Right. We're praying for all of you guys there. Uh, listen to your teacher, pray for your teacher, pray for your parents, pray that you keep safe. And, uh, just have a great day today in the name of Jesus. Okay, Dino? Bye. Say bye, Dino. Bye. Okay, see you guys next time. God bless.